Shalom, Shalom. First and foremost, before we get started, we're going to give all praises, honor, and glory to Yahweh, Bahashem, Yahweh Shai, Bahashem, Rakhakwadash. Also, double honor to the apostles and the elders of Great Millstone. And salutations to all you brothers out there. And uh, this is another, you know, side camp uh, deal that we're doing, all right, this week. And pretty much, you know, we switched locations, right? And uh, where we're at, though, is, uh, you know, a little bit busier. Okay, this is uh, more of a cheap place of, of concourse, but we're still, we're still amongst Jake. And uh, with that being said, now where, where the uh, main camp is teaching, you had this uh, this Jake uh, out of nowhere decides to you know blast some music, you know smoke a bunch of was it Black and Miles, Newports, right? All right, and basically just uh, created disturbance, man. He's not even getting on the bus; he's just sitting there. That's the, the, the demon that's activated in them, right? The point being, though, is our people, man, the so-called Black Latinos, Native Americans, all right, the Israelites, a lot of them are going to get put to death because of this behavior, okay? And in the book of Jeremiah, which we're about to read, you had the prophet Jeremiah pray to the Lord and ask for Jake to get a double destruction, okay? Because our people, they don't want to learn the easy way. All right, and what's the easy way? By listening, taking heed, okay, to what the prophets are saying and changing their life, all right? They don't want to do that. They want to continue in this madness that they're in, okay? So the Lord, he's going to punish them severely, all right? Which Lord's will we'll get in a little bit in that second Ezra, how they're going to dwell in torment, and they're going to learn everything after what? Death by pain, okay? The Lord has to uh, do these things. Because our people are hard hit, uh, Hearted, okay, stiff neck, okay, a bunch of knuckleheads, man, as my dad says, man. Alright? We're gonna start off with that book of Jeremiah about the shot. Jeremiah 17, 18. And it reads, let them be confounded yep. that persecute me. But let not me be confounded. Let them be dismayed. Yep. But let not me be dismayed. Bring upon them the day of evil and destroy them with a double destruction. All right, and so you gotta remember, yes, we got, you know, starting with Esau and the other heathens, right? They're our enemies. But two thirds of our own people are also our enemies, okay? Because the scriptures, Lord's will, we'll get in that, uh, was it that, uh, 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 Hosea, the fourth chapter, it talks about how they do what? Strive with the priest, right? They strive with the priest. So they're our, uh, our enemies as well, man. Okay, and that's who Jeremiah is talking about. Those, uh, those two-third Israelites that are coming up against the truth. He prayed that the Lord bring them the day of evil and that they die by a what? A double destruction, man. Okay? And that's what we pray for too, man. Because our people are, are evil right now. It talks about in the book of Isaiah, the first chapter, that the what? A seed of evildoers laden with iniquity. Okay? Our people, all they know how to do is, is, is commit adultery, kill. Well, I'm not even going to say kill. Murder. Okay? Yeah. Do drugs? Degenerate. A bunch of degenerate. That's what you said. It says, it says, how did that become now degenerate place? Yep. You said, I have planted me a, a, a holy, a noble, righteous people. We're right. supposed to be a noble, righteous people. But yet, our people are, are, are become degenerate here in this present time, man. Yeah. More than ever. Yeah, yeah, definitely. Because hey, we brought it out. Because Esau gives you what? A license to sin. There's no real structure and order. There's no consequences and accountability for your actions really in this society. Okay? So that's why they're worse than ever right now. Okay? And they love it, man. They love this. Because they can go out, because it's the weekend, right? They can go smoke a blunt, all right? Do some fucking perks and go to the club and act a fool, okay? Because that's what's going to happen in a couple hours, man. Drink some goddamn uh, uh, yak, all right? And act a goddamn fool. Right. I I've said it before. Uh while, while, you know, the men of the Lord, the open, the open elect, usually throughout the week, are trying to round their week out for the, for the Sabbath. Yeah. They're the contrary. They're rounding their week yeah. out for the following. <laughs> yeah. 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 Friday and Saturday yeah. so they can uh, repent and uh, go into the church. Yeah. The, the, the false ass, fake ass temple, they go repent for, 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 for all they had done and think that they ain't slapped the most I got in the face, man. Y'all watch him out in the face. No, it don't work like that, man. You repent there and don't go back to those wicked ass ways and deeds, man. I got a precept, Micah 2 and uh, 8, and it reads, Even of late, my people is risen up 
as an enemy. He pull off the robe with the garment uh, for, for them that pass by security as men adverse from war, man. Right. The Lord is telling us, man, tell, telling you that my people has, have, 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 as a lady, I have to uh, 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 fight, fight against them, man. Like, you want to be an enemy of the most high God? That's why in that Jeremiah said, give them double destruction, man, for what they have done, man. You pull off the garment, man, a water's garment, man. You can't do that, man. You're naked then, man. You're pulling off that garment, man. You have Your shame is showing, man. You are vulnerable to this wicked-ass world. Job 9 and 24, the earth was given into the hands of the wicked, man. This is a wicked-ass place, man. And if you conform to it, your ass is wicked, man. Two-thirds and the heathen. Right. Right now, we're getting on our, our people, man. Our people got to get it, man. Now, of course, the heathens, too. But our people, man, hey, man, they, they, what does the scripture say? Uh, the wise do evil. Oh, they, they surpass the deeds of the wicked. Our people are out of control right now, man. Hey, man, do, do you got, and I don't care if it's a, a white woman, a, you know, an Asian woman, an Arab woman, right? They're listening and following Cardi B, bro. Okay? Hey, and Lizzo and, and Beyonce and whoever, uh, you know, they, they, you know, of our women that are put up, you know, and exalted in this society, man. You know? Uh, all these uh, heathens are, are listening to Uzi Vert. Uh, who else, man? Uh, shit, I can't think of these rappers. I don't even know what these are. They're all a bunch of bug outs, man. I, they're all a bunch of clowns, yeah. man. It's a fucking uh, freak show, man. Yeah. All right? Uh, what was that? Future? You know, Drake, that's all they listen to all day, man. And uh, all the, all those rappers and R&B singers and, 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 and whatever, right? All they push it is just ungodly acts and activities, man. Well, when you're uh, going to the word disobedient, you mean to be unruly, you know? They're unruly, man. They, they refuse to be subject under Yahweh by me outside his way. Like the elder always says, man, anything outside of the way of your how about some other sign is death, it's vain, unrighteous, it's corrupt. You see, I got a, I got that preacher quoted. Jeremiah 4 and 22 says, For my people is foolish, they have not known me. They are sadist children, and they have none understanding. They are wise to do evil, but to do good, they have no knowledge, man. Mm -hmm. See? Alright, you look, man, you, you put Jake in, in a situation where he has to uh, uh, use his mind for good and he can't figure it out man but you put him in a situation where he can do some uh, wickedness and violence yeah, yeah, some scamming you know? yeah man all right you know some scamming uh oh what else uh learn how to you know sell drugs better right. all right uh, you uh, uh, play you yep a woman uh uh, learn, uh she, she'll she'll learn how to uh basically use uh men okay for her for her advantage oh jake is wise and all that yep but when it comes to this and they have no knowledge, and that's why the Lord has a controversy with them. Get that, uh, 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 that Hosea. Because it talks about in that Hosea that there's what? No knowledge in the no, land? No knowledge in the land. In Hosea 4 and 1, it yep. says, Hear the word of Yahweh, ye children of Israel. For Yahweh hath a controversy with the inhabitants of the land. Yep. Because there is no truth. No truth. Right? Everybody, they, man, all these people, okay. they, they're always lying. You, 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 it's hard to trust somebody, man. Yep. You know? Even though you're not just trusting in man and flesh, you're going to trust the Lord. But a friend should be someone you can trust. But nowadays, you you have a so-called friend or associate or whatever, and they're the ones that are doing it, yeah. man. Look at that whole situation with 6 ix 9 All right, that Takashi 6 9 the rapper, his own guys, right? His own crew. Yeah. Hey, they, 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 they dealt with his baby mama, all right? Hey, they, they were throwing them under the bus, you know, stealing money from them. Okay, doing all sorts of wicked yeah. shit, but then everyone gets mad that he quote unquote snitched. Look at what his crew was doing to him, right, man. Right. Get the fuck out of here, man. And even more profoundly, they, they believe in the lies of the devil, man. Esau, Edom. All right, the the, the, the the wicked rulers of this world. They don't believe in the truth of the scriptures of Yahweh by Shem Yahweh Shai. They they don't they don't see that understanding. Their understanding is is a, a, a false doctrine, deceitfulness. You see. It says, uh, 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 because there is no truth, nor mercy, 
your knowledge of the most high in the land. Our people are cool right now. Hey, you you, you uh, uh, see videos or you hear stories about them cartels, man? Yeah. Them motherfuckers are ruthless, man. Rip they'll still them. fucking skin you alive, bro. I know, man. They'll rip your heart out right yeah. there yeah. and then rip it out. You, 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 and then talk shit, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. Drake does, yeah. You know what I'm saying? You know, talking that, that shit, man. Like, damn, you put your heart out, you beat your foot dog. You know what I'm saying? We got you now. Wild, you know what I'm saying? Look at, look, 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 look at your heart beating. You know what I'm saying? You see it? It's in my hand. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, bro. I saw a video like that once they put up, and that shit did. It made me cry, man. It hurt me, man. It hurt. It hurt me to see the estate of our people, man. Because, because our people, we're here. It is. We're the most. We're the most uh, uh, special people on the planet, the most powerful people on the planet, and this is what you exercise with it? Wickedness? Learning from the from the best from the best. wickedness, man. <laughs> and then we exceedingly we ex excelled in it. Yeah. You know? Yeah. Okay, okay, just real quick, uh, 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 this is what that the wicked uh, uh, has seduced us. Uh, in other words, the righteous is more excellent than his neighbor. Where is that at? Uh, you brothers, I know some proverbs. Uh, proverbs. But it says um, that the uh, the righteous is more excellent than his neighbor, but the wicked seduces him, uh, seduces him, okay? And that's what has happened to our people, okay? Our people have been right here, I got it. This is uh, Proverbs chapter 12 and 26. The righteous is more excellent than his neighbor, but the way of the wicked seduces them. And that's what happened to our people. They've been seduced, okay? They, they, they have learned evil now. And it, 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 the brother said, now, now they're excelling, okay? All right? They're excelling. They're, they're top, uh, top of in the class right now. Right. All right? Beyond the beast, the above, beyond and above the beast of the wicked, like the scripture says. Yep. And, and that's why, that's why, that's why things like that do do that, man. That's why they'll, they'll pull up, they'll set up shop, they'll blast the music, they'll smoke their weed, they'll blow their smoke. They, they do that because it, that, that demon in them, that, that, that wickedness in them, that they love so much, that shit, it, it, it burns them, man. It cuts them. And they're like, no, nah, man, you know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying? You gotta be nasty. I ain't with that shit, man. I'm with this, I'm with this world. I'm with this shit. The shit I know all my life. Wicked, you know? They don't want to let it go, man. You know? I can appreciate that. Okay. This is Jeremiah 32 and 31. It says, for this city has been to me as a provocation of my anger and of my fury from the day that they built it, even unto this day, that I should remove it from before my face because of all the evil of the children of Israel and of the children of Judah. And, 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 and a lot of that comes from disobedience, man, from breaking that, that, that covenant, man. We, we broke that covenant, man. Y'all watching the outside didn't desert us and leave us and break his uh, part of the deal. We 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 made a deal with y'all watching the outside by blood, man. We broke that deal, man. You see? It says, it says, and the children of Judah, it says, which they have done to provoke me to anger, they, their kings, their princes, their priests, and their prophets and the men of Judah and the inhabitants of Israel, and they have turned unto me the back. Instead of turning towards the Lord, they want to turn the back to the Lord. That's, and, oh, I'm, I'm with this place. that's disrespectful, man. That's very disrespectful. You, you, in, in any situation in life, if you turn your back to somebody, that's like a slap in the face, man. And then especially, you gotta think about like a, um, imagine your son doing that to you. You will go berserk, man. You know what I'm saying? You go berserk. You gotta remember, we're the, uh, the Lord's firstborn son, man. And we turned our back. So they, the, the Lord said, okay, all right, I got something for you. And then and he threw us in this shit, man. This, this, this shit, because we're living in hell. This, is the, this has been the worst captivity ever. Hands down. Hands down. Nothing else compares to it. Okay? That's why I said in the verse 31 it says, that's why I said that I should remove it from before my face. Because the Lord, that's why it says you don't fail. It says that I got them not my children no more. That, I ain't gonna have mercy on them no more. No, I don't wanna deal with it. So they come back and say sorry and they fix it.
get it right, I'm not, I'm not gonna deal with it. You know? But that remnant, the Lord, the Lord said, hey, I'm just like the brother going into, he reached his hands out. That Isaiah, uh, 11 chapter, I believe, talks about he reached his hand out for a second time to redeem his gift, man, you know? Well, that's why in, uh, in, uh, in Jeremiah, when it says that uh, they say that if a man put away his wife, right? She, uh, 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 can I get that real quick? And that's uh, Jeremiah. Uh, and I'll say this, brother, brother, that like any father, right? His son repents, you know, says he's sorry. You take him back, all right, son. Hey, did you learn your lesson now? Right. Hey, hey. It's no way you're gonna not take your son back. Right. It's, right. it's, 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 it's uh, that's unheard of. Right. Just think about it as a, a carnal. We being a, a carnal men out here, man, with this fucked up flesh on him. Are you not gonna set your son back, man? If he come back righteous, man, yeah, you are. Now, How much more the most high? I wish I said that. He said if a if an evil uh, person will give his kids, you know what I'm saying, some bread uh, or whatever after they begging them and begging them and begging them for some, how much not more? Yeah. 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 You know, the father of light, you know what I'm saying? This dude is a fucking <laughs> demon, bro. Do you hear this shit? This dude is a straight demon, bro. See what he just said. You know what I'm saying? It ain't a nice way. Not to be started. Yeah. Yeah. This dude was cocky. All right, to mystical, the Snoop. Now this dude really got, got some fucking uh, Reverend whoever. Just fucking yeah. sing it, man. Reverend Deacon Dr. Doug. Because, because, this because shit demonic, that, that's bro. Called, that's called the Right now, he's being rattled, man. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Everything that he's doing is fucking lined up. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You know what I'm saying? And he's trying to, his mind is trying to work a way to be like, no, it's not that. <laughs> This is uh, Jeremiah 3 and 1. It says, They say if a man put away his wife and she go from him and he become and, and become another man, shall he return unto her again? Shall not that land be greatly polluted? And according to the law, if you put away your wife, right, and she go to another man, Right? Right? But it says, it says, but thou hast played the harlot with many lovers, yet return again to me, saith Yahweh. So the Lord didn't put us away. He was he didn't initiate the kick out. We played the harlot. So the Lord is like, well then I'm not gonna deal with you for a time until you come back to me. You know, return to me still. You know, the Lord called, man. Lord, Lord. Uh, because the brother brought out, uh, brought, uh, brought out, uh, uh, given the Lord has given us over to wickedness. You know, it says, uh, this is Ecclesiastes 88. It says, there is no man that has power, power over the spirit to retain the spirit. Neither has he power in the day of death, and there is no discharge in that war. Neither shall wickedness deliver those that are given into it. And that's the point right there. Who can make a clean, uh, uh, unclean thing clean, man? Only the Most High God. That's what the brother's going into. The Most High God is, a, is going to uh, 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 clean us up, wash us in His Word, you know, at an accepted point in time, man. At a certain time, man. It's, it's, and the elect right now is being washed and clean right now. Two thirds are going to die therein. The Lord's so murdered, man. So beautiful. He got so much mercy. Man. At the end of the day, all Israel is going to be saved, as it says in the book of Romans. When they come back into the kingdom, they're going to be, you know, in the right minds, they're going to be purified, and they're going to be good. You know, our power is amazing, man. But this is uh, Micah chapter 7 and 18. Who is a power like unto thee that pardoneth transgression, it's like pardoneth iniquity, and passeth by the transgression of the remnant of his heritage? He retaineth not his anger forever. Eventually it's gonna cease. But you gotta do what? Return, return, return. 
all right? And this is a whole, really, when you when you read the scriptures, it's a whole love story, man. That's right. All right? It, it, the Heavenly Father loves his children, the Israelites. That's right. Okay? And all he's asking is for you to return unto him. Repent. Get right. Then, right. then this hell that you're living in is going to cease. It's going to stop, man. But if you don't do it, you're going to continue to live in, in, in this squalor, man. This bullshit, man. Okay? And you see, hey, the, the, the one-third, the elect, they're, they're getting the point. Right. And that's why they're, they're, they're changing their ways. Okay? They're returning unto the old ways. And they're trying their best to get right. All right? But, hey, the two-thirds of our people, they, 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 they keep like, slapping the, uh, the hand of the Lord. And so the Lord's eventually going to slap them man, into oblivion, man. All right? But it says here, um, he re retaineth not his anger forever because he delighteth in mercy. He will turn again. He will have compassion upon us. He will subdue our iniquities. And thou will cast all their sins into the depths of the sea. Thou will perform the truth to Jacob and the mercy to Abraham, which thou hast sworn unto our fathers from the days of old. All right? See, uh, hey, the Lord, he's going to keep uh, his covenant that he made with our forefathers, okay? He's going to make sure that we're going to be uh, uh, on top and right at the end of the day, man. But right now, hey, we're, we're in this uh, uh, purging process, okay? And there's going to be a great slaughter, man, very soon. Because our people don't want to get right. They, 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 yeah, um, they, even in the law, it says, what? Well, if you have a rebellious son... They, they, they won't listen to you, your, your, your mo uh, uh, his mother, right? He doesn't want to listen to the uh, to the, to the elderly, you know, the heads of the, uh, uh, the the village, right? So to speak. What do you got to do with him eventually? You got to put him to death. And that's what's going to happen to the two thirds. If they want to be that rebellious son, they're going to get that that judgment then of a rebellious son, which is getting put to death. All right. But can you finish that in there, that um. Hosea, and then we'll get whatever precepts. I just want to make sure we, you know, hit this, man. Because the Lord is all about uh, removing uh, sin from Israel, man. You know, ultimately. You know, yeah. and that's why the brother brought it out. All Israel shall be saved with everlasting salvation, world without end. Yep, that's right. But the two thirds are going to have to be uh, reborn from the Lord of the elect, man. Because they ain't going to get it on this side, man. Right. That's the Hosea. Or, and uh, continuing in verse 1, it says, Because there is no truth, nor mercy, nor knowledge of the most time in the land, yep. by swearing, and lying, and killing, and stealing, and committing adultery, they break out, and blood touches blood. Isn't that in uh, uh, every Jake area? Yep. Lying, stealing, yep. killing, right? That's, that, that's all that's uh, done and talked about in our community. Uh, this has become their song. Yeah. Yeah, you know? yeah, yeah, real talk, man. Real talk. This has become their song. Alright? This is this is the so-called black culture, so-called uh, 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 Mexican, Puerto Rican, uh, Hispanic culture. It's to kill each other, to commit adultery upon each other, to steal from each other, to deceive each other. See? That's what they got. You, that's what they get. They gave you their name, black man, because black yep. is every, everything comes out the black is bad, man. Yep. And Jake, Jake, punk has, uh, 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 and, and, you know, rest is being and held onto it, and it's holding on tight to it, and won't let it go, man. You're not black, and they're not white, man. Social constructs, man, to get do against one another to show superiority and inferiority, man. And guess who you are, Jake? You're the fucking low man on the total floor, man. The lowest, man. But in the spiritual aspect of it all, man, you're the highest man, man. But the Lord has brought you down low because your attitude against him. Hey, hey look, like right now, police oh, officer, he hit the corner all, you know what I'm saying? Gangster like, and they, he, he got a smirk on his face looking at him like, you know what I'm saying? But he's seen every throat. A quick side note, this is actually a faith booster. Because while all these people are being disobedient, you have the one third, the elect, 144,000 men, those that have the spirit of the Lord upon them, the Rakakwadash, literally translated spirit holy, that are doing the work and the will of Yahweh Shem Yahweh Shai, man. That ought to prove that these things are real. The Lord gonna come for real. And it's not gonna be nice, man. That's the thing. 
Because right now the, ta the talking is happening. I see when you, uh, your howl sends his son, your howl shot. Okay? Hey, there's going to be no more talking. It's going to be just straight action, man. And the Lord is going to kill a lot of you people, man. Hey, hey you, you're complaining about a fucking fall. Oh, there's a food desert in our neighborhoods, man. It's going to be a real famine soon, man. You're not going to be able to go to fucking church's chicken, all right? The fucking McDonald's to go get some fucking uh, uh, flaming hot at the gas station. That's just going to be done, man. All right? You people are going to start eating your damn kids, all right? Eating your pit bulls, you know? Your cats. Your cats. Your, your, your goddamn mom. That's what's coming, man. Do you think it's bad now? Hey, you think uh, oh, these car, uh, the uh, that's uh, uh, are bad? Wait till they start kicking down uh, your doors, man. And they start raping you, okay? I don't care if you're a man or a woman, man. Because nowadays, hey, all these men out here are fucking moles, man. All right? They're gonna start, hey, they're gonna rape you, rape your woman, rape your dog, and then fucking eat all your food, and then they might eat you, man. Hey, hey, man, back. I came to the truth, man. I was in the hood, man. I was out there fucking gang banging and shit, man. All right? I've seen it, man. I've seen it with my own eyes. You have these motherfuckers. They, they be super thugs. They in the back blowing each other. Yeah, yeah, yeah. All right? That's, that's, that, that's the reality of what's going on. That's the reality. Of, that, that's why uh, the Lord told, um, he told Ezekiel, he said, looking through, look through and see the, 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 what they what, what, oh, yeah, uh, yeah, yeah. what they do, man. Uh, uh, yeah, they kind of, kind of, Ezekiel, what, four, I believe, or nine? What they do you know? in secret or something? Yeah, I forgot man. how it's worded. It's a shame what they do in secret. That's, uh, that's, no, no, that, that one's another, like, I think, Colossians. Where it's yeah. a shame to speak these things. Yeah. All right? There's some vile shit that goes on. It's going to get worse out here, man. Kid, look, man, kid, kidnapping is going to go up. All right, breaking and entering. Uh, 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 rape. Uh, uh, prostitution, sex trafficking. All right, drug use, and drug that, overdose. And that's the thing right now, man. That's why they always show sex and all these things in these demonic movies. That's the avenue of the of the devil, man. The flesh, man. The, he is carnal. These people have our people have become carnal, man. And, 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 and see the thing, see in this society, sex is just so uh, loose, so to speak, right? Yeah. And it's very, it's actually a very sacred thing, man between a man and a woman, all right? It's a, it deals with a lot of a transferring of energy because when a man deals with a woman, now he's putting his spirit, his energy into her, man, okay? All right? It's not a, 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 a loose thing. It shouldn't be just seen as nothing. That's why back in the day, man, if a woman wasn't a virgin, man, she should be looked down upon. Now this shit is exhausted, but point being though is that hey, man, they, these lewd acts are gonna increase, and that's why everyone's so fucking cool out here. You know? I mean, when you got a man popping another man in his booty hole and his, his, uh, his stuff ejaculates in him, that puts a weird spirit on that dead dude now. You know what I'm saying? Why do you think all, when all these kids get touched, right, when they're young, you know, when a young boy gets touched, he's all messed up then, man. You know what I'm saying, when he grows up. Now, now, now he's all confused. He, 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 he's getting constant pain. Now he starts you know, re, uh, re, doing reenactments of things that, he, uh, that happened to him. Now he's a, a, a pedophile. Now he's the predator, the aggressor now. You know? So this is, hey man, tell me, man. Hey, but what you people want, so you're going to get it. But uh, finish it off, man. Uh, Hosea 4, and now verse 3, it says, Therefore shall the land mourn, and every one that dwelleth therein shall languish. Look at this shit, bro. Just, just pan around, man. Just pan the camera around, I'll just Look at everybody. Just fucking through, man. All right. Smoking fucking new ports. Don't know what they're gonna eat. Where they're yeah. gonna sleep. Dying by. We're, we're worried about getting. Uh, they gotta worry about uh, getting home, right? Because they're worried about getting shot. Uh, either shot by the cops. If that's not happening, they're gonna be shot by their own people. Like, which, which that, that's actually uh, uh happens more. Life, you know what expect, life expectancy 55 to 57. Right. People are fucking done, man. And that's because they don't follow your how about Chanel shots. And fucking good for them, man. Fuck them, man. And if they if they don't want to serve your how about Chanel shots, may the Lord give them a, a double destruction. Right. Fuck 
Jake, man. Did we even pull that out yet? Yeah, we, we, we ready, man. Fuck Jake, man. I gotta emphasize that shit, right. man. And the brother brought out, uh, like, no, it's all good. You got it. The brother just brought out, uh, 57 to 70, the like expectancy. Yeah. What? You talking about now? Mm -hmm. You talking about now? These guys are getting shot down and taken out in the street tremendously, man. That's the Lord's hand, man. That's judgment, man. Yeah. Hey, they're, they're, they're all uh, they're reaping what they've sown. Okay. Right. That's all that's happened. Since they since they've all sowed uh, corruption, wickedness, murder, all right, uh, covetousness, adultery. Now, now since they've sown those things, now they're reaping. Yeah. All right, boys, finish this off. You got more? Uh, they hold, uh, yeah. Hold a little bit more. It says. It says. Read it six out. Keep going. Read it six. Hosea 4 and 3, it says, Therefore shall the land mourn, and everyone that dwelleth therein shall languish with the beasts of the field and with the fowls of heaven. Yeah, the fishes of the sea also shall be taken away. Yet let no man strive nor improve another, for thy people are as they that strive with the priests. Exactly, they strive with the priests. And it's clearly not a pastor, poor chop, T.D. Jakes, okay? You know, you know, Father Garcia. All right, none of them. Hey, but when it comes to the true men of the Lord, what do you see? Hey, last week we we, we had we had that fucking that piece of shit, man. You, you know, that, that fucking piece of shit, bro. Damn, they're fighting with us. He, he's this close to uh, Elder Yaki and Elder Uriah. This fucking close, bro. Trying to trying to be fucking tough, man. You know what I'm saying? We had to deal with that fucking bullshit for what? 30, 40, 45 minutes? Damn, we are aware of the fuck they are, how long you was there for. Right. You know? But, but they don't do that at, at the Christian church, man. No, you know what they're doing at the Christian church? They're contemplating on making a contract of how they going to start to marry the same sex individual. The Lord's going to kill two-thirds, man, all this fucking shit that we're talking about. Because the church needs to run. They obey, they obey, they, they obey Satan, man. Yep. They obey Satan, man. They conform to this world, man. That's their God right now. What does it say? Uh, I forgot. I think it's in Corinthians where it says, the God of this world has blinded them. Right. Roughly paraphrasing it. Right. And they've been blinded, man, by, uh, by the God of this world, which is whom? Esau and Edom. Right. He's told our people that, look, Anybody that, that loves your race, that looks like you, they're the enemy. They're the problem. Right, right. Fight them. Don't right. fight me. Actually right. worship me. Right. Look, forgive me and yeah. love me. Right. <laughs> Give me money too. Right. Right. <laughs> you know? And that's our people. Right. It, 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 it's insane, man. And, and it's clearly working because, man, I always bring this out. You'll have Jake, right? We'll be in the hood. You'll be Jake on Jake Brown all day long, right? Now, what happens during gentrification, right? You'll see Esau moving in, the other heathens. Those same people that were doing those uh, Jake on Jake crimes, are they doing the same shit to the heathens? No. They're inviting them in, got the, yes sir, yes sir, got their head down, walking, don't yeah, even look in their damn direction. Yeah. Well, I got some uh, fucking tamales for you. Here you go, free of charge. Walking away, talking about, oh, I, I, I like this. Yeah, exactly. They hate, you know? they hate themselves and each other. It's fucking crazy, man. It's like how we were saying over there. That they'll lose their mind if you accidentally bump into them. Like, yeah. oh, oh, you, you got all oh, sorry, I didn't, I didn't yeah. see my bad. Yeah. You know, excuse me. Yeah. This dude was ready to kill you. Yeah, pull the pistol out on you, man. Yeah. Ah. Pull that pistol out on you real quick, man. Yeah. This shit's wild, man. Hey, hey, that's what it is. Where, where, where I live at, man, I can't let my kids out. Every time I let my kids out, there's a whole bunch of kids who want to jump on me, who want to jump on baby. And you think I don't want my children to play with their own? I do. But at this point, you know what? Don't even fucking, don't even say nothing to them, baby. Don't look at them. Don't say hi. I don't want to be like that, but hey. Okay. You, you, you got to protect, protect your own. Hey, but the scriptures say, uh, and it's crazy, man. This is why we're, we're, uh, we're, uh, we're hastening. 
you know, for the Lord to come back. Because what do the scriptures say? In, um, I think it's in uh, maybe Zechariah. It talks about how our children are going to be uh, playing in the street. Yep. See, in this society, we got to worry about this. Like, well, we're worried about uh, uh, pedophiles kidnapping them. Um, uh, uh, how you said, deadly kids uh, jumping them. Well, we got to worry about these things. See, in the kingdom of heaven, we're going to be at peace. Our children are going to be all, you know, all good. The elderly are going to be good. You know what I'm saying? And I say that to, 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 to strike a point, you know what I'm saying? That you would you would think that my kids would be, you know, I could let them go and it'd be straight. But there's a different spirit upon my children than there is on the other children, man. They're mad because you're bro, a lot of you these know? kids they don't got their daddy around. Well that's what I'm they're, saying. They're, that's you know, like they're the, being they're, raised to be violent. Uh, contentious with each other. You see, you see them with each other. Because uh, uh, that's how it was when we were, when I was growing up. Black boxing. You know what I'm saying? You bite the uh, uh, you know, so-called homeboy to your crib to play video games. Put you next to you know, two of your Nintendo cartridges in there. Oh, yeah. You know what I'm saying? You know? Oh. I was I was when I was leaving for camp today. There was two little uh, two, two little jakes on the side of the street with water guns. They they just rolling up to every single car that passed by. Exactly. You know? And then so if you if you get upset about that, then you got the older Jake coming out talking about something I dare you to do something to my kids. You know what I'm saying? But you're teaching your child to be on rule. In the future, your child you you, you just destroy your child's life. Yeah. Hey, you can take a, a, a you know, he started with Esau and a fucking black Puerto Rican and Mexican woman for this shit. They're the ones who are raising these kids and look these little fucking monsters out. But then they're the true. same ones that are going to complain. Why is my car getting jacked? Yep. Oh, well, 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 how come there's no good men out here? Because they just they look at you, man. Yep. And you rejected all the so-called good men, right? Yep. They're a bunch of lames and losers. Yep. Okay? Yep. Somebody that he, that he didn't excite you enough, right? right? And now this is the result of it, man. Because, yeah, you know, then they didn't want any order in their fucking life. Now, now, now this is the result of it. Fuck Jake, man. Hey, this is this is order according to Jake right here, man. You know, just this. Uh, 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 like... like Get your fucking uh, some, some tobacco shit, man. Chicken and beer. Chicken and beer, and you got there's probably a bogus ass church, man. That's all they're gonna have in our neighborhood. That's it, man. How many famous rappers and shit have made albums with the title Chicken and Beer? You know what that means? That talk about where you came from, cause that's all you see, Chicken and Beer. This is fucking terrible, man. But you don't see this shit in, in, in the Esau area, all right? No, you see, Moab is you or, see, or whoever, you know? Like, what, 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 you see, uh, 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 fidelity, uh, 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 Real liquor, yeah. stuff that doesn't have additives. That yeah. when you drink it, it's actually beneficial. Because remember, 
drinking is actually good for you in moderation, all right? When you have real red wine, that helps your body out, okay? When you drink, you know, real tequila, real cognac, real whiskey, that's good for you, of course, in moderation, yeah. But hey, something I want to do. Jake's yeah, yeah, yeah. Liquor, all right, some, 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 some bogus tequila yeah. that's not even real. Mad tequila. dog 2020. Yeah, fucking mad dog. <laughs> that's something MD 2020. That shit is designed to make Material. you go mad. Yeah. yeah. Designed to make you turn up. Well, Jake is all bugged out, man. I remember one time I rolled up with, with, with one of those, man. Probably with a future, man. Top of the future shit out of you. Good. I don't want to see you in that shit again. Come on. That's why they put it in. It's Oak Mountain Liquor. Like your brother said, Oak Mountain Liquor is only in our neighborhood, man. It ain't in these neighborhoods, man. They got prestige. They got uh, the ultimate. They have the the the, the, the golden, the golden uh, of the golden uh, in their uh, uh, in their prime areas, man. You know what I'm saying? That's it, man. Live it up, Esau. Be glad. 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 The so-called Negroes, Latinos, Hispanics, and Native Americans are the true biblical Israelites of Yahweh Ba'ashim Yahweh Shai. Teaching, teaching the word of God. Fresh. Good. You were young, man. Yeah, going to the fire now. Hey, but shit, finish this off. I don't even like this. They irritate my fucking spirit. Hosea uh, right now 4 and 5 says, Therefore shalt thou fall in the day, yep. and the prophet also shall fall with thee in the night. Mm -hmm. And I will destroy thy mother. My people are destroyed for lack of knowledge. Yep. Because thou right. hast rejected knowledge, I will also reject thee. Yep. And that's what the Lord has done. Because our people have rejected knowledge, the Lord has rejected us. Okay? And it's evident. That, yeah, that's why you, you don't see the Lord all right coming to their to our people's aid when you know somebody dies so to speak all right or when somebody's hooked on drugs so on and so forth you don't see that all right and that's because they, they, our people have rejected knowledge man and there's going to be uh, continuous murders in our, uh, our um, amongst our people continuous old overdoses continuous theft so on and so forth the definition of ghetto. Um, it reads, uh, the meaning of ghetto is a quarter of a city in which Jews were formerly required to live. Okay? It says, uh, that's, that's why it's not, uh, that just right there alone just proves that we are the people of the most high. All right? Whenever, anytime you hear about the ghetto, okay? Hey, what comes into your mind? The first person that comes into mind is a so-called black man. And second in line is a Hispanic man or a Native American. That's it. And that's what brought the, brought the definition up. There's a, one more definition I want to bring up. There's, there's ghetto also, and it's uh, the Urban Dictionary. The first one's uh, uh, Meridian uh, Webster, right? The second one is the uh, Urban Dictionary. It says, an extremely twisted, an extremely twisted slang used by the so-called ghetto uh, people. And it's like the brother just said, when you think about the word ghetto, uh, you know, you think about the, 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 the first and foremost, the black man, right. and Hispanic man, you know. Yeah. It, these are the twisted slangs, man, that are used, man. And what, one of the biggest slangs we, that they put on us, man, is black, man. Yeah. Yeah. Worst thing you can call a person black, man. Yeah. And then we call ourselves black. Are you fucking out of your mind? College graduates calling themselves black, man. You know, you got big, big, big degrees on the walls, right. man. But you haven't taken up. You spent uh, eight years in college, and you haven't taken the time to look up the word black. Right. Are you kidding me, man? Right. Then shit. Hey, something. Hey. That's a right? They get all the money and all that, and they will try to do what? Get out of the hood. Yeah. Right. And then they go so-called up in the area. Now all their money is going to who? He saw him and he's back. All right. Sure. And, and nothing's uh, helping the, the, the so-called the, the so community out. 
thou hast rejected knowledge I will also reject thee yep. that thou shalt be no priest to me seeing thou hast forgotten the law of thy power I will also forget thy children yep. hey, the Lord is about to uh, um, destroy a lot of Jake's men uh, Isaiah 1 and the 1, and it reads the vision of Isaiah, the son of Amaz, which he saw concerning Judah and, Ju and Jerusalem in the days of Isaiah, Hezekiah, Lotham, Azaz, and Hezekiah, king of Judah. That's, that's, that's another one, right? Yeah. Uh, verse 2, it says, Hear, O he, hear, O heavens, and give ear, O earth. For the Lord has spoken. I have nourished and brought up children, and they have rebelled against me. Okay, what does it say? Uh, uh, Jeshua? Right, correct. And his wife's back, man. Uh, the Lord gave us everything, so to speak, man. You know? Our, our people became, uh, what's the word I'm looking for? Uh, not appreciative of it. Ungrateful. Ungrateful. All right. They became uh, rebellious. All right. It's tacky, low level. You got JJ. They, they, they think that they, man, because you, you got to earn things, right? You got to put in that work. You got to do right in order to, you know, to reap benefits. Our people, man, it's like a spoiled kid. Right? They, they have everything their, their whole lives, and now they believe that they just deserve it. Right, right. That's our people, even to this day. They really think they deserve everything, man, even though they didn't put any work in it. It's nuts, bro. Our people are sick in the goddamn mind, man. Yeah, that's part of the curse. They just got right in the head, man. They, 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 they don't uh, believe in accountability. They're you know, like, why is this happening to you? Happening to me? Where has God was loved us? That's you know, one of the worst things. That's one of the worst, that's one of the biggest problems with Jacob. The lack of accountability, man. Yeah. That's why a lot of, lot, of, lot, of, lot of guys, they come, they step up to the plate, and then they're like, you mean I got a swing? Oh, I don't get no more. You know? You know? You've been trying. You've been trying. You've been trying. You've you know, you gotta keep going, man. You gotta keep, you gotta keep, it's, a, it's a fight, bro. Yep. It's a fight. Anything that you do, man. I said, I said, like I said, one of my lessons. I said, uh, obedience, uh, faith, uh, being towards the Lord, uh, 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 trusting in the Lord. These things are tools that you have in warfare, man. If the Lord has given you, you said faith is a gift. These are the tools that we have. Go to your utility belt and begin to use these tools, man. Prayer, fasting, the brotherhood. These are the tools that we have, man. No, take one and just throw in the rope. Isaiah 1 and 3 and read, the ox knows his owner and the ass his master's crib, but Israel doeth not know, my people do not consider. You know? Our people don't care, they don't 
don't consider, they don't know anything, man. They, they're just lost in the sauce, man. Hey, they're just a slave to their flesh. Do as thou will. If it feels good, do it. You know? That's why the Lord's gonna kill them, man. Yo, like, like even those two young uh, Jakes that were on that scooter right now, you can catch it, right? But they were like, you know, probably like 12, 13, 14. Yeah. And, you know, the one was really, he looked at us like, and he was like, what the hell is this? He was, you know, far fetched, you know, to see us. And, you know, in his mind, you know, you could tell, like, he was like, what the hell? Like, but instead of they telling the homie, just sit down, you know, you see, what, you see what they're about, they just kept going. They probably clowned him. Oh, of course, no doubt about it. You know? You know? But, but then again, but then again, the Lord said it's going to be the strength of their salvation. Yes. This is part of our yeah. salvation. Yeah. And that was strange to them to see men. It's strange to a lot of old adults. Not even those those 12 or 13 year olds, but the adults just walking. They're, they're looking, they're, they're stopping their cars. Yeah. They're on the car. Yeah. And they're looking, they're looking like, what the, what the yeah. you know, just like your brother saying, what the hell? Because it's, it's strange to them yeah. to see brothers out here. We're standing up for the Lord, man. And just like the lady just, uh, Yelled out to the, the car. What, what are you guys doing? That, that, I was just thinking that. <laughs> what are you guys? Like, what are you, you know what, what are you guys doing? You know, know? <laughs> we're, 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 we're claiming, man. We op we openly uh, 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 praise our Savior, which is what you said in the uh, man. Uh, openly, you know. What about yeah. God? This is about the Most High God. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> you know? Uh, yeah, uh, verse 4 says, Ah, sinful nation, a people laden with iniquity, a seed of evil doer. That's talking about the Israelites, right? Okay, they're a sinful nation, all right, evil doers laden with iniquity, means things are stacked up, all right, they sin upon sin upon sin upon sin. Uh, our people are messed up right now. We're, we're really in the worst case scenario, real talk. Real talk. Just like you said earlier, you said we're in our worst condition. Yeah. Ever of all captivity, you know? So we have lost our heritage, man. We lost our name. The Father, the Heavenly Father's name, the Son's name. We lost, we've, lost, we've lost everything, man. And the Lord is a beautiful thing. It's a righteous thing. The Lord is showing favor on men that He's bringing back right now, man. He lift, he's, they're standing upon their feet. The Lord is blowing the breath, putting his breath back in them, and that's it. And once the Lord does that, it's a wrap. That means this place is a wrap because the Lord, before he does anything, he puts his servants out here to preach the gospel and warn the people. He said, warn them for me. Yep. You know? It says, so like you know, they're here from there. They're here from we know the majority of our people, they're not going to hear this. They're going to prepare it. You know, they're going to put it to the side. You know, see, see it as uh, nothing. See it as uh, nothing of relevance. Right? You see, at the end of the day, that's going to be for their destruction, my man. Okay, with them and now it's going to be just purely of our, of our, of our time. That's what these last three things are. Let's finish up on this one. I said one more again. Ah, sinful nation, a people laden with iniquity, a seed of evildoers, uh, children that are corruptors. They have forsaken the Lord. They have provoked the Holy One of Israel unto anger. They are gone away backwards. You know? They're gone away backwards. All right? Sinful nation, people laden with of doing good, now they're doing evil. What is this? They, uh, they call evil good and good evil. All right, they, they see this as an evil work, but it's really righteous. Okay, but they they, they, they think all oh, you know things that little dirt is doing. Okay, they, 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 that's a good thing. Uh, all this dude talking about is committing adultery, killing, stealing. All right, talking about licks, so on and so forth. You know what I mean? Saying no. Hey, you know, the ops, you know what I'm saying? That's fucking good, right? right. It's fucking uh, over. Get the fuck out of here, man. Right. Right. I thought the Lord's gonna fucking destroy this shit, man. Hey, man, hey, man. I, we were talking about this in class, man. Chicago, man, has got a fucking special judgment, man. A real special fucking judgment. This right. is one of the most fucking demonic places on the, uh, in the world, man. That's right. The city of shit, man. 
you got you you got New York, right? That's the, the head of Babylon. Okay, to the heart of Babylon is Chicago. Shalom and the Papa Paul. The Papa Paul is a speaker. 